welcome this is the energy vibration reading for um the aries sun moon and rising sign i want to say thank you to all the aries out there thank you for the wonderful support likes and shares um uh this is wonderful um this is um, um the month of um, june the month of june is a positive month because um you guys have um the energy of the sun uh, the energy of the sun is a positive positive energy um, that is there for you um, there's positive situations that come to best well hope um, and um, what you can't even realize here is that um, during that you have the energy from the sun um, there is oak on the positive energies that come to benefit for you in this amount for you so for you um, Aries mention um, the overall energy is the energy of the Sun Mar um, there have you all made to mark met um, on the positive energy between years to make have you made to mark met the zodiac energy from the look okay that's the um, years to um, three week have you the zodiac energy from the look met the energy of the look um, done have you um, made to crack um, um, met um, uh, unverwachte dingen, maar ik kan op een positieve manier. Dan zal ik van jullie um, in de tweede week hebben een emotioneel, uh, zeer emotioneel week. Oké, okay? dus we gaan hier even um, kijken um, wat hier gaan even spelen en. Um, for Yuli, Yuli crack hook the world. There was an on the zodiac energy that cracked the world, but Yuli crack hook of the world. This we got even further, we got even kijken what to forward in this month of Yuli for um, Yuli Ram Manson. Here we kijk by uh, the sess van um, Stav, the sess van Stav, the Squee news. Goeie news come in the ears to wake from Yuli for Yuli. Act positive good news come in the first week from you in the third week we have the energy from the princess from cups that come in this week energy from the princess of cups um, um, this um, good news it can from the prince um, and there's a good news can over the princess from cups then happen by the energy from um, the fear from Pentacles um, that you prepare your financial situation in balance um, uh, to krijgen. Okay, you prepare your financial situation in balance um, to krijgen. Then have you the energy from the make of Swade in the last week. Okay, this as I look at your month with um, good news, um, positive news is uh, up, up back now you too. Um, but, um, that positive news have you made to mark uh, my financial situation now of the last week in the month then how you act uh, situation so it's um um yeah you begin a zorker to mark the connection to send um the sis from once um the news that come in um, you have the energy of strength the energy of strength okay so um, someone um, who uh, is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion who's um, younger than you are are going to bring it this could be information from your daughter it could be that your daughter um, is about to go to a new school and um, yeah she needs more help and that sort of a thing middle of the month you have uh, the second week with the water energy the princess and the Pentacles is a situation with money okay and you it's as if this person is going to um, bring extra work to you and and this is going to be helping you so whoever this princess of cups is it's as if she is going to be helping you out and um, it's as if she's going to say to you, you know, why don't you come and work with me? And that sort of a thing. And this is going to be good because it's going to be helping you with your financial situation. As we look at the energy, 
with the energy of the four of pentacles and the nine of swords you have the energy of the five of pentacles so, um, whatever the situation is um, you're worried about your financial situation in um, the third and last week because in the third week you're trying to balance out your financial situation so you're worried about your financial situation and most of the time it is not to worry um, you know just know that your your financial situation is going to be better and people said how do you do that it's because you need to, to believe in it and know that you know I am going to make it this is going to happen my financial situation is really going to be better as we look at the energy of the strength with the energy of the eight of Pentacles because you're working very hard but yet still you are tired you have the seven of swords the seven of swords energies um, just keep on coming up for a lot of signs whatever is happening in June and I'm seeing the energy is the energies are so changing because I'm seeing a lot of negative situations that is playing out for a lot of people in this year it's as if other people become so horrible I'm seeing all these negative situations because the seven of swords came up in so many other people reading then we're looking at what is coming out with the eight of Pentacles and the five of Pentacles you have the four of Pentacles so you are tired you're overworked yourself and you are tired you need to make take time and balance the number four energies is going to play a significant role in your life whatever the situation is the number four energies I'm seeing a lot of situation that you have to deal with your kids they're on vacation um, they're about to go to new school a lot of you are trying to work hard to make sure that you can meet um, that um, money for that school and that situation you end up with a ten of ones a lot of worries a lot of worries a lot of worries is coming up um, with the energy of the ten of ones because whenever the energy of the ten of ones is a lot of burdens you're carrying a lot of burdens so whatever the situation is a lot of you will be carrying a lot of burdens on your shoulder in this month um, you need to understand that you need to ask for help you need to ask the universe for help whatever the situation is um, you need to ask the universe for help okay and as you ask the universe for help then um, you are going to be finding out that um, the help you need will be coming in okay so be aware of this you have to be right on top of everything you have to know exactly what is happening in your life okay so as we look at the beginning of the week the month the first week and second week there's obviously someone out there that has um, a, do a daughter or a son that is and um, Pisces cancer or scorpion mm -hmm. and this person whoever this person is um, going to need to have to, to do some the stuff with financial situation and that sort of a situation okay so um, I'm gonna look and then see the seven of swords is here so let's see what is the energy of the seven of swords um, the seven of swords it could be that some of your energies is that someone is stealing your energies and yes they can okay but someone is stealing your energy yes they can be aware of this okay um, and that, that's why you can feel tired because when people are stealing your energies it's as if you're always tired you're always tired you want to sleep that sort of a thing um, you're feeling out of energy and, and call upon the Sun and ask the Sun to replace the energies in you okay as we look there's a lot of worry about money it's a lot of worry about money people you have to be um, positive um, you're bringing all these worries don't do it just know that everything is going to be good um, okay let's see what is going to be the outcomes of all these worries that you're sending out you are going to be okay you're going to be okay when this energy comes up um, this is a powerful energy but this is saying that you know um, something is it's going to work out um, this is the energy that comes up that said it's, it's, it's going to be working out and there is a message that you will receive about money how much is it a lot of people like to ask how much is it but um, that is it they, the angels always said no um, let them um, the angels are going to say no 
um, let them be surprised okay because your angels and guides like um, to know to, to see when you're surprised okay so um, be aware of this okay um, the other energy is um, the energy um, of um, the bear is always a, um, a stark um, it's like your power your personal it's, it's your personal financial um, power but yet still it's as if um, a message is going to be coming about money so money is going to be coming in so and um, this is the energy of the bear and th there is the energy of a message coming in so um, not to worry about your financial situation because it's going to be okay the last week um, you will receive message of money coming in okay so all right let's look at what is going to be transpiring so the central of um, the month of June for you guys is hard work a lot of you be, will be working very very hard some of you are planning on going on vacation and you are working very hard to make sure that you have that financial stability that is coming okay a lot of you are going to be working hard and you are going to make sure that you have that financial stability that you need to um, receive and it is going to be um, coming in okay so uh, that, that is um, basically a wonderful um, month because your worries are all going to be um, fading away because um, whatever the situation is um, the worries about your financial situation is going to be leaving you as you uh, end this month of uh, June okay we are now going to look at what is the energies that are coming through um, in your um, in your love uh, love work um, situation in your love um, work situation we're going to be looking at the energies that is coming out in your love and work situations okay um, this is going to be um, very very positive um, because what is happening here is that um, you're going to be realizing um, that you're going to be changing um, your whole uh, energy vibration whenever it comes on to love and that sort of a situation you are going to be realizing that you're going to be changing that sort of an energy that is coming in okay so um, this is going to be good all right so we're going to look at the king um, the king of ones 45 and older what is coming in in your private life if you are not working and for the people who are working what to expect in June you have the energy of you balancing out situations so a lot of you um, kings um, a lot of you men um, 45 and older you're going to be balancing out your financial but also your materialistic world so that could be in work that you're balancing out situation in work and that sort of thing what is happening um, for um, money there is going to be an offer coming in there is going to be an offer coming in so um, a lot of you are going to have an offer coming in okay so whatever the situation is a lot of you are going to have an offer coming in in love you're going to be having a situation with your child um, is this if um, a situation that is transpiring in your child life is going to be the most important thing for you um, it could be a same-sex relationship that you are with someone who is a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn sometimes that comes up as same relationship okay for the ladies over 40 you have a situation with a six of cups um in work um, you're meeting people of past lifetimes okay so um, for you guys you're meeting people of past lifetimes you need to be aware of the situation you're meeting um, people 
um, of past lifetime and you need to be aware of the situation then um, we are looking at the energy of the queen um, of um, and this is someone over the age of 545 that has to do with your financial situation this person is either blocking your financial situation so you need to be aware of this person so think who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Sagittarius uh, um, Aquarius a Gemini or Libran because this person seems to be blocking your financial situation then in love in love you have some regrets you have a whole lot of regrets in love whatever the situation is you have a whole lot of regrets whatever the situation that is happening you have a whole lot of regrets to do with this queen of sword because this is someone who is um, who is an, um, an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra let's look at the people between the ages of 25 and 45 what is happening in your private life you're feeling good about yourself and this is good you're feeling really really good about yourself and this is positive um, in work it's going to be going good for you positive energy is coming up for you in a work and in your private life let's see what is happening for your money situation you have the wheel of fortune so this is wonderful a lot of you will be receiving extra financial help that is going to be coming in a lot of you will be receiving extra financial help that will be coming in and then we have the energy of the two of swords in love so in your relationships you're going to be seeing the truth of a situation so uh, this is with relationship with your partner or relationship with other people um, who you love you're going to be just seeing the truth of a situation with them okay as we look at the, um, the people 15 until 25 to see what's happening in their personal life um, you are having um, the seven of coins some of you are uh, studying maybe you have to redo an exam so you're um, studying hard um, maybe you're going to extra school extra lesson and in um, your financial situation um, you have the nine of ones you're trying to stand and you're ready for anything but yet still you're protecting yourself you have the energy of the nine of ones that is here so you need to be careful of um, people around you in love heartbreaks so some of you people are going to have some heartbreaks whatever is happening some of you people are really really going to be having heartbreaks that are happening you people are going to have um, some heartbreaks that are coming up okay so you need to to be careful we are going to go ahead and look at the zodiac energy so um, we are going to go ahead and look at the situation that has to deal with the Sun sign people what is going to be happening for the Sun sign people you're going to be dealing with the Pisces for the Sun sign people some of you will be dealing with the Pisces and this is the princess of cups which is in your general reading a lot of you will be dealing with the Pisces and then let's look and see what else you'll be dealing with the Aquarians and that is the Aquarian lady um, the woman that came up for you ladies you're going to be um, dealing with the Aquarians and, um, and this is a situation of an air sign let's look and see what is happening for the people who were born in the night we have the energy of Pluto so you'll be dealing with the scorpions so that could be um, the princess of cups in the second week could be a scorpion person um, that you are um, dealing with and then as we look forward we are dealing with the Virgos so some of you could be dealing with the Virgos okay um, that is happening so um, whatever is happening around you you need to understand that certain people comes in your life to bring out a certain energies for you and whatever these energies and situation are um, these are positive good situations so you need to understand that. let's see what is going to be the overall outcome a message so some of you will be receiving a message there is going to be a message that is coming and um, the message was about um, money for some people is a message about who 
or um, going to change school new schools and that sort of a thing that is uh, coming in and this is going to be um, very very good okay so um, ladies and gentlemen um, um, be aware there is arguments that can come up a lot of arguments that can come up in this month um, a lot of you are carrying a lot of um, situation on your shoulders so be aware of this I want to say please listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign and share these videos and I want to say namaste until next time